What's going on, you guys? So I have another uh, Dell Optiplex. This is 3040, gonna be a teardown. I'm just gonna use the Phillips head. Get the thumb screws in the back. You're gonna slide it to the left, the side cover panel. And you're gonna move the front cover basil. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna disconnect the hard drive in here to three and a half inch. And you're gonna press on this right here to slide it. I'm gonna also disconnect the optical drive here. And it slides off also like that. So I'm gonna grab the, the flathead screwdriver. I wanna remove the SATA cables. And disconnect the CPU power four pin. This is for the power switch right here in the corner. I'll get a flathead screwdriver. Uh, it's got an internal speaker also. And what I will do is I'm going to pull the video card out. And to do that, I'm just going to you know, lift it up like this gently. Your finger lift it up at the same time, then you pull the video card out. It comes out. See right here, you lift this up and you're going to pull it. Now, what I'll do is I'm going to need a Phillips head. And there are three screws in the back uh, to remove the power supply. So there's going to be a little secure pin here. And you're going to click on it right here to take a flathead screwdriver, you press on it, and it'll slide to the left. Now, what I will do is disconnect the fan. And to remove this, I have to use a flathead screwdriver. It's got an 80 millimeter fan in here. So what I will do is I'm going to switch to this side like this so you guys can see better. I'm going to start off here in the corner. And there's one screw here also in the corner.
There's another one here, the middle. And there's here in the top, right there in the corner. Now what I'll do is I'm gonna go ahead and we disconnect the CPU cooler. Now what I'll have to do is I need to get a napkin, paper towel, quickly, and I need to get a. I need a rubbing alcohol. Wipe it off quickly. Uh, basically, I'm using the ninety-one percent. So what I will do is I'm going to wipe down the old thermal compound before I pull the CPU out. So I want to show you guys this way. Right here like this generally and just pull it out slowly and I'm gonna go ahead and pull the motherboard out here's the motherboard it's basically like a micro ATX, but uh, it's a little bit longer right here because it's built in USB ports. So it's like, this is micro ATX, but they made this uh, integrated USB ports in the front and audio. So what I will do now is be remove the internal speaker see the internal speaker here in the corner on the bottom and just you press on it right here in the bottom top like that and it comes out pull it and be the last part here's a power switch and just take a flathead screwdriver like this and And it comes out. So basically you're gonna press on right here in the top and the bottom like that. You press on it and it comes out, pull it. The power switch. And this does not have a IO shield backplate in here. It's basically built into the case and it's not removable. See you guys at the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.